Welcome to Pop Share. Pop Share is show and tell, story pop style. For today's Pop Share, I am pleased to introduce you to. Um, can I get a drum roll, please? The Beta Fish. Well, hello there, my fantastic little friend. Well, beta fish are well known for their vibrant colors and their flashy, fanned out fins. Also known as the Siamese fighting fish, betas are freshwater fish native to Southeast Asia. See this small container that our friend is swimming in right now? Well, this is only a temporary home. This little fish needs room to stretch out and swim and live its best fishy life. Here are some interesting facts about betas. Betas are very interactive with their pet parents. Because they have a curious nature, they enjoy watching their surroundings and they love visual stimulation. Hey! Some beta parents even draw different shapes and designs with a dry eraser marker on the outside of their fish tank to keep things fun and fresh for their little fishy friend. What do you think? What would you draw for your fish? Great idea! I think I would draw a skateboard in case my little beta here felt like going for a little skate around its tank. Over time, some people even train their betas to eat right from their hand at the water's surface. Betas eat special food and require more protein than other fish. Betas can also breathe air. These guys are also very territorial. This means that although they enjoy interaction with their pet parents, it's best they live alone without fellow fishy friends. Oh, and that fin fanning they do? They normally flare their fins to defend their territory or if they feel threatened or scared. I think he feels okay right now. You're not scared, are you, little buddy? Placing a mirror in front of a beta for a short time will often fire up your beta enough to fin flare. But you don't want to do it too often or for too long because we don't want to cause our bright-eyed bubbly friend too much stress. Plants and other decorations can make betas home feel more comfortable and interesting. When they sleep, they may doze off at the bottom of the tank on a leaf or a little log. So make sure you give them a special place to live. It's also important to keep their water clean and at a healthy temperature. Between 75 and 80 degrees Fahrenheit is just right. We don't want to have to knit teeny weeny beta sweaters to keep our finny friend warm. Right, buddy? So what do you think? Are you a fan of the beta fish? Me too. I think they're so beautiful. Now owning a pet, fish included, is a big responsibility. So keep in mind that they'll require daily feeding, attention, and care before taking on being a pet parent. I am so excited to be a beta mom. Now I just need to think of a name. What do you think? What should we name our little beta fish? Betty? Okay. Burton? Great idea. Fabio? Maybe. Ooh, Veda. Veda the beta fish. Well, aren't you clever? Well, if you have an idea for a name for our new story pop fish, email us here. Well, my bubbly buddy, what do you think? Do you think it's time for us to get out of here and get you settled in your new home? I think so too. Well, I sure hope you know how to snap. <laughs>